okay, imagine the scenario. You book an outbound demo, and on the beginning of the call, the prospect says this. Sure, we'll check out your demo, but we're really happy with our current vendor and probably not going to switch. What's going on here? The prospect is asserting a higher power frame than you have. They're kind of up here and you're down here. You're in this what I call down position. What I'm suggesting is you don't want to be in a down position. You don't want to be a monkey performing because protecting your time is a good skill to master and you're going to do a disservice to the prospect as well. I'm not suggesting that you be up here, but I am suggesting that you have an equal power frame as your prospect. You might not know how to do that because maybe you haven't been taught. So what I'd like to do in this video lecture is teach you how to do that in a way that won't make the prospect defensive and that puts you here so you don't waste your time or theirs. Here's what that might sound like. Prospect says, we'll take a look at your demo, but we're really happy with our current vendor, so we're not gonna probably switch. You pause for a second and you might say this in a calm voice. Sounds like they're doing everything perfectly. Or you might say, seems like they're checking every single box. Or you might say, sounds like you wouldn't change a thing. One of those options, and just listen for a second and see what they say. Um, that's gonna get you right to here because again, you're not an order taker. Uh, another option is this. Sounds like even if you saw something that you thought was valuable, you wouldn't even consider switching. And then pause and listen to what they say. The idea here is to protect your time, sense when you're hearing a higher power frame, be aware of it so that you can be on an equal power frame. Knowing how to protect your time as a sales professional is a good skill to master.